We are in the middle of our gold prospecting trip with very good results in terms of gold nuggets the previous day. Nice! Best patch I've found in a long time, or ever. Oh, <laughs> it is gold! What a nice chunk! Starting to get a bit of collection there. It's only been here for three hours. Sounds massive! Oh, <laughs> nice! Close to an ounce, 23. Still a bit sore from detecting and digging all these holes. We head back to our patches today, wondering if the area yields any more gold for us. We are back out on our patches here this morning. Clint already took off to go to his area where he picked up maybe two ounces in total now. I'm back here on my little patch. The flies are obviously horrendous again. So this was one little center area and then I found them all the way down to the creek. I want to concentrate my search starting from that tree there and then I'm going to move probably up to that next bigger tree there. I'm just going to walk up and down in lines up the slope here until I run out of gold. Morning guys, day eight. We're back on the patch again. Chrissy's on her little spot and I'm, I'm just walking up the creek line and I've got one in the creek. And it sounds not bad. And as you know, the bigger one got to find the creeks. Swing at it, get the flies out of place. Oh, yeah. As soon as you wake up, fly. It's a chunk. Wow. Over two grams, I reckon. Put in the sun for you. Nice way to start the day. We're onto our first target of the day. I wasn't even going to film this one, but I scraped the surface and it's very loud and still in there. So it definitely sounds bigger than the average piece of gold we got off this patch. I'm just going to scrape out the dirt by hand, see if we got it out. No, it's still in there. Could be a nice one. Sounds big. Still in the hole. Yeah, I doubt I'm gonna see it because I can't really see much with this fly screen. And it's sunny today for a change, so I got the sunnies on. Nice, it's still in there. Oh, it's still in there. It's got to be straight down the middle here somewhere. I think it might be a nice one. So I really don't want to scratch it with my pick because gold being such a soft metal that happens very easily. Oh, <laughs> it's the biggest one yet, I think. Definitely the largest one yet. Oh, look at that. That's the first one of the day. And what a brilliant way to start the day, if you ask me. That would be, I'm gonna call it a seven grammar. What a nice piece. There you go. First piece goes in there. So Clint and I decided to only do half a day today because we are stuffed. It's physically very exhausting digging all these holes. Of course it's a lot of fun and we found a lot of gold in this area too. But today we're only going to call it half a day because there is no point of flogging our bodies until we can't move anymore. I've got another one in the creek. I've already um, 
dug it down. I didn't bother filming at the start because it was only really silent. Just improving as I go down. Still in there. Just have to widen it a little bit. I've got the bigger coil on. Oh, see it. Another one. So they're about the same size as the last one. A bit deeper in the creek. Yeah, I did have a quick look around uh, the top area there now. I gridded up another little section. <laughs> that was a fly and it wasn't the first one today. Yeah, I'm very lucky I got that first bit today because it's been very quiet since I already widened out the previous search pattern and I got no further signals. Not sure where to go now. Maybe it'll pop back up and yeah, we just haven't walked over it over there yet. Another one just under this tree. This is deep as that last one, it should be. That's a bad sign. Yeah, start sound better than now. in there. Much rather dig a big hole like this for a bigger piece than the hundred little holes like yesterday for the same amount. So I'm actually down in the creek now having a look and I haven't had one single target here yet. One hot rock I think but that was about it and still only the one piece of gold so I can really hope that Clint is having a bit more luck although I'm not complaining about a big nugget that I have but yeah it's just a bit rare and weird that I haven't had any signals and yesterday they just kept on coming 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 I'll just keep swinging We've got another good sounding one in the creek. Not far from the first one that we got. Hopefully it's still in there. No. Oh yeah. Oh, not bad one. So a bit over a gram. Good point. I'm sort of running out of options, I think. I don't know where to keep going. Haven't gotten any more gold besides from the first one in the first two minutes. Now I'm actually widening out around my old grid patterns, but on either side I haven't gotten any more targets yet, so I'm not sure how much sense it actually makes, but I'll keep circling around the grid pattern and hopefully we'll get a single floater somewhere so we can widen out the grid pattern again. Chain lines, and this is the best down of that for a while. The rest of the band just the specs. Oh, yeah. 
bit. Point two or something. And yeah, the rest has been even smaller than that. All that up, as they say. But I see Chrissy down the hill, she's gripping down there. Hopefully she's still fine in the colour. Yeah, I've just caught up with Clint. It looks like he's got quite a few nice bits there. Good on him. So he was digging gold the whole time. But now I'm actually downstream of his patch down in the creek. He's just up the hill there. So that should be far enough that we don't interfere. And he got a couple of nice bits here this morning. Chrissy just showed me that chunk she found. What a beauty that is. That's the eight grand at least. Well, she's down in the creek where I was this morning. I only walked through there, so I can go down there and try to find another one. I've got another not too bad signal up the top. Point two. Not bad, but we're only going to go for another half an hour or so. Find a few more and then head off. Yeah, I've gotten a couple of hot rocks, but this signal here definitely sounds a bit better. Sounds very good. Uh. Oh, there it is. <laughs> yeah, maybe not quite a gram, but still, it's actually quite rough for being down in the creek here. Yeah, nice bit. At least I got one more, but the deal is we can go home once I find a big one. So that's what I'm looking for can't really call this too big. Glad to have it, but I'm looking for a bigger one. Oh, tangled everywhere. So I've finished gridding the middle of the patch, so 20 meters wide and to the top of this little ridge here. Now this is starting on the side. We've got a couple of little ones already. This one for sure. It's real hard to get it out of this shaley stuff. Little one. Oh, super clean here. Real clean. Fingers crossed this is going to be something good. It's right down from one of Clint's gold holes this morning. Well, we got it. I was hoping it was going to be a bit deeper. Oh, I saw it. Where is it? That was a nice looking bit. Here. Yeah. Nice chunky two grammar. Beautiful. Got another one here. Already out. Plus, it's been sitting on top. Little one covered in dirt. Little tiny one. Hoping for a big one to see the day off. Well, at least two gram or something. That'd be good. That'll be another one. Nice. Sounds big. Oh, get all my eye. There. 
Nice flat bit. That'll be another gram. Good. So I'm hoping for maybe 10 grams in total now. Plus I think Clint has at least half an ounce there. So slowly adding up here once again. Could this be the two gram that I was hoping for? Maybe. Gotta be at least a gram. Over a gram, I reckon. Maybe just on a gram. Not bad. Yeah, I'm stuffed. Clint wants to take one more target, and it looks like he found it. Oh, these holes are tiny ones. Yeah, nice. Yes. I don't know. Time to go home. Okay. Grab my stuff. Okay. This is just a little one. Number 30? Number 50? No, I don't know. <laughs> Probably. Good job. Let's get all of these flies. Yeah. Once again, Chrissy flogged me with the size. Look at this. <laughs> nice nugget. And once again, Clint flogged me again with the total weight. Seems to be an ongoing thing. <laughs> Heaps of little ones. <laughs> you nailed it out there again. That's a good spot. Yeah, not wrong. We'll be busy for a few more days yet. Yeah, I reckon. Although I was a bit disappointed that my spot dried out uh, pretty we, fast. We found another little bit for you to attack. You'll be busy digging tomorrow. Sounds good. All right, let's weigh it. See how much the big one weighs. It is fairly skinny. But it's got a lot of surface. It's close to 10 grams, isn't it? Yeah, I think it looks bigger than what it is. I'm going to go six and a half. Yeah, there's a bit hollow in the middle. It looks big, but it yeah. doesn't have much weight to it. Seven or eight. Ready? Ready. Oh, you weren't far off. It is close to six and a half. Of course, the breeze just picked up again. Yeah, it was nice a second ago. Six and a half. Plus, yeah, I was going to say 11 all up, but I think uh, slightly under. Ooh. Oh, close. 10. 10. Yeah. Still good morning. We only did four hours. That's so right. We both had a couple of big days, so we sort of take it easy today. Okay, I'll take these off. Put mine on here. Yeah, look at all those. How many holes did you dig again today? Lots. Some of the better ones, like in the creek down the bottom. Mm hmm. Is that a bit of red? Bit of dirt stuff to it, right? Beautiful piece of gold. What do you reckon that one? That one? I reckon maybe five. I'm gonna say four. Four? Put it on, we'll see. Oh, four point eight. Nice bit. Oh, we'll just chuck the rest on it. Yes. Bring it up to close to an ounce. Yeah, 20. Oof. Yeah. 21. Oh. Mm. Flies know that I'm busy. Yeah, they take advantage of that. These are the little tiny ones. That's it. Nice. Nearly 24. Good job. Well done. 
<laughs> yeah, we did it. We got to the ounce. Yeah, that was the goal for the day, wasn't yeah, it? In half a day, it's pretty good. Day. Nice. Yeah, good work. Yes. That doesn't happen every week or month. That's very rare to find a spot like this. Very rare. It's getting harder anyway. So we'll give our bodies a rest and then do it all over again tomorrow for a full day. Yeah, we'll do a full day tomorrow. Mm, sounds good to me.